Just digging this hole and I come across this. Looks like a huge musket ball. Well, it's a cannonball. Cannonball or well, musket? Well, it can't be a musket ball. It's too big. It's got to be over an inch across. Well, either this is some sort of small cannonball, or I don't know what it is. How bizarre! Yeah. I wonder if it's got any gunpowder inside. Where's the fuse? Bit small, I think. A bit of a lump there. No. I have to get a toothbrush. Hold on, I'll be back in a minute. Do they call these things grape shot? Or is that bit? It's a bit big for a grape shot. Went very deep. Boat. Five, six inches? Something off a tractor, maybe? I don't know. Weird. Well, people used to have cannons, small cannons as toys. Perhaps it's one of those like toy cannons, where it, like the noonday gun, like, you know. I'll have to get my uh, Fines Liaison Officer to check that one out. Perfectly round. Hmm. Interesting. But well, I just found this. Just in the side of the plug. Well. I wonder if it's bronze. Hold on. I'll just get me metal detector. Oh, that's me watch. No, I think it's iron. Still, interesting find. Looks like a spearhead that's hit a tree. Iron Age spearhead. Or perhaps the Roman. Dunno. Nice imprint. What do you think? Fallen off a car? I've got some writing somewhere. It says, if you can read that, looks like Zircon. Oh, perhaps it's fallen off a spaceship made of cast iron from the planet Zircon. Yeah, sure that is. Yeah, it's an N, it's a C. Zircon. Oh, yeah. A cast iron spaceship. Right, we've got a signal here. Eighty-four, eighty-five. But I think it's going to be iron because if you draw back away, you get the iron grunt. So I reckon this is a horseshoe. I'll take a look. Right. Well, it ain't a horseshoe. It's got lots of holes in it. It's a thing with lots of holes in it. Well, it looks like it's had a stud at some point.
could have been an ox shoe, they're similar. But I don't know what this is. How bizarre. Huh. Can anyone tell me? There we go. Took me a bit of finding this one. I kept getting nails. But it's a nice little key. Don't think it's a bow tap key because the hole's a bit on the small side. Yeah, that's nice. I found a nice bow tap the other day, last weekend. It was lovely. But uh, I found about six or seven keys, but never. Oh, well, I've now found a bow tap. So a key for something. Nicked it, look. Too small a clock, that was. Well, on to the next. Oh yeah, I can see it pouring now. Well, I've just come back into the field after that long shower. It took about half an hour. Everything's starting to dry up again. I've just popped a club clot and I've got a silver coin. Silver. There it is. Silver coin. Nineteen twenty eight. Yeah. George the Fifth. I haven't had a silver coin for ages. Nineteen twenty-eight. I'm pretty sure that's um, seventy-five percent silver. I think there's a cut-off date in there. I'm not sure when the cut-off date is. It we might be on the cusp of it when they start to pay, making them out of. Um, 50% silver. You know, six pence. You used to put these in your Christmas pudding years ago. Lovely. Oh. I think it's a coin. Oh, it is. It's a coin. Oh, no, it's not a coin. It's not a coin. It's got a little thing for suspending it from. Ooh, it's got something written on it. I better go and clean this up. Right, on this side it says what I can make out crowned. Oh, oh. Um, oh, I'm gonna have to get a bit closer. Hold on. 26th of June 1902 and it's got the the Queen standard facing downwards so it's obviously um, a jubilee you know the crown crowning ceremony a camera a camera a relative um, sort of chocolate box token type thing and then it's got a face there pointing to the right but I can't read that side too badly worn yeah, that's what that says. Commemorative, that's it, that's the word. So it's probably a chocolate box token, like that VC one I dug up the other day. It's got like a starburst on it. Stunning. Right, I'll go and clean this up. I'll be back in a minute. Look at the detail on that. That is stunning. That is gorgeous. Don't think I've ever found such a good button. Geometric design. Oh, that's like a sort of stun, sunburst. 